Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Um, it has been a while since I upload a video as I uh, was pretty busy with the uh, festive season. Uh, in Singapore, we do celebrate the Chinese Lunar New Year. So it has been uh, two weeks or rather 15 days of eat, eating, drinking and uh, meeting up with friends and relatives. Well, uh, as you can see, I have a new um, unboxing video and this is a gift from my husband and, and this is from Kate. Okay, I got this. Uh, we only have time to look at, to go to the boutique and look at it uh, a couple of weeks back. So um, it's my belated Valentine's uh, present from my husband. So without further ado, let's uh, get on to the unboxing. Okay, um, so it comes with a um, travel pouch. Okay, and um, the receipt. Okay, this is the receipt which I'll not be able to uh, show you yet. Um, I'll talk about the price later on and also it comes with a certificate um, so looking at this you will know what I've gotten okay I'll show you the uh, certificate um, after I've unboxed the jewelry so, okay so it comes with a pretty beautiful red box Okay, this is my first uh, Cartier jewelry. So, um, okay. okay. Okay, so it's something which is not that popular. Um, because I think some most people would prefer the classic version but for me I, I prefer this design as it suits my uh, lifestyle better so um, let me just open up the box and here you go so this is my first uh, Cartier Love bracelet in the 18k pink gold uh, this is the calf version okay let me take it out from the cushion so i like the convenience of the open bracelet because it allows me to take in and out uh, without someone's help so um, because for the full version you actually need someone to help you as it's actually uh, comprises of two half bracelet uh, secure each end by, uh, by, a, by a screw by two screws I think okay so this one is in um, size 17 okay so okay and you could see I'm not too sure whether it's showing it will show but this is the um, Cartier, it has Cartier uh, behind and it says that it's a uh, size 17. So it comes with an uh, authenticity certificate without the uh, serial number and my SA's uh, name. Okay, so it comes, it's uh, 18K uh, gold and yeah, so it says here the design of this collection embraces a rich history since its inception in 1970 it has become recognizable all around the world symbolizing everlasting love okay. I bought this bracelet in uh, Singapore okay and so this is the receipt Okay, so the price of this bracelet is um, 
six thousand one hundred Singapore dollars. Um, initially, I was thinking of going um, to purchase this bracelet uh, during my trip to Europe in April, uh, which is next month. But after doing some research on the internet, I went to um, the um, France, France website of Kate and I realized that the cost savings is very very little if not if I'm not mistaken it's in fact minus uh, I mean it's in fact probably it costs probably about the same price as in Singapore um, maybe I'll save a little due to the uh, tax refund but then I think it's probably not worth the um, effort uh, so I decided to buy it in Singapore instead. However, I think the cheapest place, country to buy the bracelet from is in Hong Kong. Um, I th it probably costs about three to four hundred dollars lesser, but I will not be going to Hong Kong um, during at least not in the first six months of this year. So, yeah, so that's why I decided to buy in Singapore instead. So let me just uh, show you uh, my, the measurement around my uh, wrist. So my wrist measured at about um, 15, 15 centimeter. And the bracelet is in size 17. So let me show you how I put on the uh, calf bracelet. Okay, okay so uh, I, I've actually um, learned this method from the uh, you, some YouTube videos and also some one posted in the um, uh, purse forum in the Cardia thread so uh, I, I look at it and I find that it's pretty useful because um, you don't actually try to force the bracelet on your into your wrist you have to do some kind of uh, rotating of your wrist uh, to get the bracelet in so let me take out my um, Kelly uh, dot bracelet first. Okay, so what you do, you see this uh, soft part of your wrist. Okay, so you just need to push, okay. push, relax, relax your hand, push one end of the bracelet into this part and rotate in turn your wrist into the bracelet okay of course I'm still not that um, uh, good at it but at least it doesn't leave a uh, uh, red marks I mean it still does it still has a little bit of faint red marks but it's definitely better uh, as compared to the first two days that I have um, uh, tried to put on the bracelet okay, so, so how I usually stack the bracelet is that I would stack it with um, my bracelet my MS bracelet okay so for taking out is uh, pretty much the same okay so uh, okay for taking out I think it's easier if you could um, put uh, use your body your your belly 
uh, to sort of like stabilize your your hand. Okay, so for taking out. Okay, so same thing. Try to to push the end. This end into the soft part of your bone. Okay, and rotate out. So it's more like trying to rotate your wrist rather than to try to force the calf into your hand because it will definitely hurt your wrist if you try to do that. Okay. Alright, so I hope this is this video is um useful for you guys and um, have a good day and please like and subscribe if you have enjoyed my video and i'll see you in my next one thank you bye